So with this video, I want to demonstrate the proper way to take apart a clarinet, take care of your reed and store your stuff in your clarinet in your clarinet case. So let's just start with taking it apart, just one piece at a time, very very carefully. One piece, barrel, top joint, and the bottom joint and the bell. First thing you need to do is take care of the reed. This is just a, a saxophone reed that I put on here for demonstration purposes. Always take it out of the ligature, very, very carefully, ligature, and put it in a case. Do not leave the reed on the mouthpiece. As it dries, it will warp. It's wood. So you need to put it in something that will hold it uh, still as it dries. This case here is what it comes in, and it is okay. You have to slide it in there very, very carefully and make sure that it's in there. A better way to do this is to buy one of these, which is $3. Keep two reeds in here. Slide that in there. So you can put one on the other side as well and have two reeds going at the same time. That will keep it flat as it dries, and it will protect it, and it's easier to put it in there rather than in the case that it comes in. Once you have that done, you need to clean the inside of, of the clarinet. This is uh, just a rag that you can buy for about $5. We have them here. And you drop it through each section. Drop it through each section and pull through. Clean out, clean out all your spit. Everybody has spit. Once you're done with those two sections, you can go ahead and put up the, uh, the mouthpiece. The mouthpiece always has a cap that comes with it. If you have a ligature like this, it has a specific type of cap that comes with it. Putting the cap on it protects the mouthpiece. If you break or chip the mouthpiece, you're just done for and you're out another $30 to $35. So always put the cap on once you've cleaned the inside out. Make sure it's on the correct way. And then go ahead and put it in the case. Put the barrel in if you've already cleaned it. And you can do the same thing with these two parts. That is one way of doing it. Another way is what they call, what is called pad savers. These are about $15 for a set for a clarinet. And you can do that. And you can do this, or you can just do this. These pad savers go inside the clarinet, like so. And you store it like that. All the wetness that's on each of the pads that's inside there will be absorbed into those pad savers. And once you're done with that, you can put everything carefully into your case. Wrap this back up. Stick it in the little storage compartment that's in the case. Put your read in there very carefully. Close the case. You're ready to take it home and practice, or if you're at home practicing, you're ready to bring it to school the next day.